Hello everyone, welcome back again to FN Engineering channel. Today, we are going to design high pressure piping equipment, especially for straight pipe thickness calculation, as per SME B31.3 using a spreadsheet or Excel program. Previously, we have discussed the concept of high pressure piping calculation as per SME B31.3. If you don't see yet the video, I recommend you to see the video first because the video completely related to this video. Moreover, we suggest you to watch this video until the end so you will get this information completely. Here is the study case problem which has to be solved using a spreadsheet or Excel program. We have internal descent pressure 6000 psi. Internal descent temperature 200 degree Fahrenheit, nominal pipe schedule 6 inch, and pipe material using SA333 grade 8. We will make the Excel calculation or spreadsheet calculation like this. Start from a blank sheet. Before we continue, please support this channel by like this video and subscribe FN Engineering channel. Thank you. First of all, we need the equation. We copy the equation to blank sheet. We start to type the parameter description symbol value unit remarks internal design pressure P in PSI unit, internal addition temperature, in degree Fahrenheit, Ostad diameter, or uppercase D, in inch, Lower stress or S in PSI unit. It can be obtained from table K1 in appendix K. And don't forget to add the correction allowance. In inch unit. Well, we will fill the value for all parameters. Internal descent pressure is 6000 psi. Internal descent temperature is 200 degree Fahrenheit. Global stress defined in table K. I have found the sum data in the database. Global stress for pipe material using a333 grade 8 at 200 degree Fahrenheit is 48 KSI or 48,000 PSI. Outer diameter we will find in SME B36.10 for NPS 6 inch. The outside diameter is 6.625 inch. Corrosion allowance, we assume the value 0.125 inch. To easily understand the parameter, we give some colors. 
for input we give yellow color for data from database we give brown color assume data we give blue color and green color for calculated data Transition pressure is input data, also in transition temperature. Allowable stress is data from, we can get the value from database. Okay. Same with global stress, so the matter, it can be obtained from database. Cost allowance, we assume this value. Okay. Now, we will calculate required thickness or T. We use equation 34A because this is the common material and also the diameter is given. We input all parameter to this equation. Outside diameter divided by two, multiply with this equation, one minus exponential of minus P per S. Don't forget to add the correction allowance. We get 0.514 inch for the required thickness. After that, we assume the nominal thickness based on the required thickness value. We have to choose the nominal thickness greater than the required thickness. The nominal thickness of pipe can be obtained from SME B 36.10. Uh, based on the table, we use the nominal thickness greater than 0.5 inch, so we use the schedule 160 or 0.719 inch. From the nominal thickness, we calculate the finish thickness because we have to consider 12.5% of pipe under tolerance. Finish thickness or TF. We get the finish thickness 0.629 inch. Lastly, its conclusion: the thickness is acceptable if the finish thickness greater or equal to required thickness.
we can see that the finished thickness 0.6 to 9 is greater than required thickness 0.514 inch. So the thickness using schedule 160 is acceptable. Well, we have stopped the study case. Alright everyone, thank you for watching my video. If you have some comments or suggestions, please write on the comment column. And if you get something new from this video, please like my video, subscribe to my channel, and turn on the notification from this channel to get updated video from FN Engineering channel. See you next time.